Welcome back to the channel. Today, we're diving into the fascinating world of fintech. In this video, we're going to uncover 10 lesser known facts about fintech that are sure to surprise you. We're talking about the history you didn't learn in school, the behind the scenes tech that powers your everyday transactions and the potential pitfalls that nobody's really talking about. So buckle up, hit that like button to help the algorithm bless this video and let's get started. All right, let's rewind the clock a bit. When you think of fintech, you probably picture sleek apps and complex algorithms, right? But the concept of fintech isn't entirely new. Its roots can be traced back to the 19th century with the invention of the telegraph. The first form of fintech emerged with the establishment of the first transatlantic cable in 1866, revolutionizing financial transactions. Before the transatlantic cable, it could take weeks to send and receive financial information between Europe and North America. The telegraph changed all that, paving the way for the high-speed interconnected financial markets we know today. Now, let's fast forward to the 21st century and talk about artificial intelligence. When you hear AII in the context of fintech, you probably think of customer service chatbots, right? And yeah, those are pretty common. But what you might not realize is that AI is working behind the scenes in much more powerful ways. One of the most significant applications of AI in fintech is fraud detection. Sophisticated algorithms analyze massive amounts of data in real time, looking for patterns and anomalies that could indicate fraudulent activity. These AI-powered systems are constantly learning and adapting, becoming more accurate and efficient at identifying and preventing fraud before it even happens. This level of security wouldn't be possible without AI. Let's talk about blockchain. Now, whenever someone mentions blockchain, the first thing that pops into most people's minds is cryptocurrency, right? Specifically Bitcoin. And yeah, it's true that blockchain technology is the backbone of Bitcoin and other cryptocurrencies. But here's the thing, blockchain's potential applications extend far beyond just digital currencies. At its core, blockchain is essentially a decentralized and immutable ledger. This means that it's a secure and transparent way to record and verify transactions. For example, blockchain can be used to create more secure and transparent voting systems, making it much harder to tamper with election results. It can be used to track products throughout the supply chain, ensuring the authenticity and ethical sourcing of goods. And it can even be used to securely store and share healthcare data, giving patients more control over their medical records. Chapter 4 Neobank's rapid growth. Now let's talk about a more recent development in the fintech world, neobanks. These digital-only banks are serious contenders in the financial industry. What's remarkable about neobanks is their rapid growth, reaching millions of users within just a few years of launching. Neobanks offer a level of convenience and flexibility that traditional banks just can't match. They're entirely app-based, so you can do all your banking from your phone 24-7. Neobanks are also known for their lower fees and more competitive interest rates. They don't have the same overhead costs as traditional banks, so they can pass those savings on to their customers. Chapter 5. Fintech and Financial Inclusion For billions of people around the world, access to basic financial services, things like bank accounts, loans and insurance, is still a distant dream. This is where fintech comes in. Fintech companies are leveraging technology to reach underserved populations and provide them with access to essential financial tools. Mobile banking apps allow people in remote areas to access financial services using just a basic phone. Micro lending platforms provide small loans to entrepreneurs in developing countries, helping them start or grow their businesses. Fintech is breaking down barriers and creating a more inclusive financial system empowering individuals and communities around the world. Chapter 6. RegTech Revolution The financial industry is heavily regulated and for good reason. But complying with all these regulations can be a complex and costly nightmare for financial institutions. This is where RegTech, or regulatory technology, comes in. RegTech companies are using technology to help financial institutions navigate the complex world of regulatory compliance. AI-powered solutions automate compliance tasks, reducing the risk of human error and freeing up employees to focus on more strategic work. 
Data analytics platforms provide real-time insights into regulatory risks, allowing institutions to identify and address potential issues before they become major problems. RegTech is not just about making life easier for financial institutions. It's about strengthening the entire financial system and protecting consumers from fraud and abuse. Chapter 7. Now let's address the elephant in the room, the environmental impact of cryptocurrency, specifically Bitcoin. While Bitcoin and other cryptocurrencies offer a lot of potential benefits, there's no denying that the process of mining these digital currencies consumes a significant amount of energy. We're talking about massive amounts of computing power being used to solve complex mathematical problems in order to validate transactions and secure the Bitcoin network, and all this computing power requires a lot of electricity. In fact, Bitcoin mining alone consumes more electricity annually than some entire countries. The cryptocurrency industry is aware of this issue and is actively working on solutions. Now, let's talk about a trend that's blurring the lines between finance and everyday life embedded finance. This is all about integrating financial services into non-financial platforms. Think about it. You can now buy products on Amazon and pay for them in installments using Amazon's own financing options. You can book a ride on Uber and pay for it seamlessly through the app using Uber Cash. The idea is to make financial services more accessible and convenient by integrating them into the platforms and apps that people are already using every day. Now let's talk about a trend that's shaking up the world of investing robo-advisors. These automated investment platforms are becoming increasingly popular, especially among younger generations. Robo-advisors use algorithms to create and manage investment portfolios based on your financial goals, risk tolerance and time horizon. They eliminate the need for human financial advisors, making investing more accessible and affordable for the average person. Robo-advisors can rebalance your portfolio and make adjustments as needed, ensuring that your investments stay aligned with your goals. Now, let's end on a serious note, cybersecurity. As fintech continues to grow and evolve, so do the cybersecurity challenges. Fintech companies are prime targets for cyber criminals because they hold valuable financial data and often operate with less stringent security measures than traditional financial institutions. We're talking about the constant threat of data breaches, phishing scams and other cyber attacks that can compromise sensitive financial information and cost individuals and businesses millions of dollars. Fintech companies need to invest heavily in robust security measures to protect their systems and their customers' data. So there you have it, 10 mind-blowing fintech facts that you probably didn't know. From its ancient roots to the potential pitfalls, fintech is a complex and rapidly evolving landscape. Which of these facts surprised you the most? Let me know in the comments below. And while you're down there, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to the channel for more insightful videos like this one. Stay informed, stay secure, and I'll see you in the next video.